Eva Lingoria criticizes Hollywood for treating people unfairly. According to Eva Lingoria, female directors of color don't have as many opportunities in Hollywood as white guys do. I felt the weight of my community. I felt the weight of every female director because we don't get a lot of bites at the apple. The Desperate Housewives, alum said at Cannes of her feature directorial debut, Flamin' Hot, during the Caring Women in Motion talk. Lingoria, who has helmed episodes of Black-ish and Jane the Virgin, acknowledged that it had been 20 years since a major movie was directed by a Latina. We can't get a movie every 20 years, she said. So the problem is if this movie fails people go, oh, Latino stories don't work. Oh, female directors really don't cut it. She added, we don't get a lot of at-bats. A white male can direct a $200 million film, fail and get another one. Right? She said she felt like going into filming, flamin' hot, we get one at bat. We get one chance. I gotta make it right. I gotta do it well. I gotta work twice as hard. I gotta out-hustle everybody in the room. I gotta work twice as fast. I gotta do it twice as cheap. You really carry the generational traumas with you into the making of the film. The 48-year-old said those pressures, fueled, her. I was just like determined and excited for the journey and we have a beautiful film, she said. Based on a 2013 biography, the Disney Plus original series, Flamin' Hot, chronicles the inspiring story of Richard Montaez, a Frito-Lay janitor who helped disrupt the food industry. Latinos are still underrepresented in front of and behind the camera, according to Lingoria, who said that, we're still not tapping into the females in the Latino community. Lingoria added, so the myth that Hollywood is so progressive is a myth when you look at the data, saying there is an illusion of equity in the industry. I mean, yes, we had some wins but like no, we still have so much more to go. According to the actor, employment discrimination in Hollywood is more often the result of unconsciously hiring who they always hired, than deliberate injustice. Since she started her production business Unbelievable in 2005, Lingoria stated she hasn't seen much change in the depiction of Latinos in front of the camera.